So the other day, I decided to get on and warm up my Widowmaker in Quick Play Classic by playing Reinhardt. And honestly, it was going pretty well. Oh shit, charging it was up a little. Base hawk. Huge. Oh, I shot him down. What? Team, this is creating space. But then we were seconds away from losing, and then, well, this happened. I right, watch this. Watch this. I'm gonna swap to Widow, and I'm gonna carry right here. Okay, got two. I got two. There's a rhyme behind us. He's anti. I got three. I got three. Dude! Oh my god! Dude! <laughs> oh my gosh, dude! <laughs> Holy shit! I saw that the shot in the window when I died. Dude, I was totally. Wow, dude. There's something about playing Widowmaker on console I'm after her nerf that, that makes you want to rip her hair out and never play her again. But when you can play her right, she's one of the best heroes in the game, and that's what this guide is here for. Why is it in here? Alright. How many characters in this game take skill? Why are you playing Widowmaker? She just you just clicks ahead and they all get one shot. So I've shown my settings like 20 times, but I still get asked for it, so I'm gonna put this in the vid super quick and never speak about it ever again. Here are two settings that have worked really well for me in the past. I think the biggest tip I can give for settings is that if your shot feels a bit off one day, then you should adjust your aim assist window. When I first decreased my window, I felt a huge improvement, and since then I've been alternating it depending on if my shots are hitting or not. Okay, so hook shots aren't just fancy montage kills, they're actually a super useful part of Widow's kit and can be used to get a quick pick from an angle that the enemy doesn't see coming. Every map has at least one super useful hookshot spot. Here's an example of a shot on Anubis that works literally every time. If you want to practice these hookshot spots, then here's an easy way to do it. Load up this custom game. Pick a map. Put Widow in Widow spot. hookshotting her. I highly recommend getting good at hookshots in order to win games more often. So a common misconception in lower ranks like Diamond and Below is that a Widow has to constantly be getting picks in order for the team to engage. This just isn't true. 
what you should be doing is patiently waiting for your tanks to engage with the enemy team so you can hook up and get picks while the enemy tanks are distracted. That's what creating space is. In some cases where you feel like you're hitting your shots but your team is struggling to engage, that's when you need to try to be more aggressive to be extra valuable for your team. If you're confident in your shot, go for a ballsy flank to open things up for your team. Overall, just try to remember that you don't have to be getting a triple kill every fight to be valuable. Just getting a pick or two every now and then while applying pressure will help your team out so much. This aim trainer mode is a good way to practice your shots against different hitboxes. I made a full video on it already though. But yeah, that's it for this vid. I tried to keep it short and useful. Hope it helps at least a little bit. I'll see you guys next time.